Outlaw Sports is brought to you by Molson Canadian, made from Canada, and Rocky Mountain Barbecue, Alberta barbecue cuisine at its best. With all the recent activity in the center position, Grabowski in Toronto, Hemsky in Edmonton, all getting monstrous five million a year deals, the Calgary Flames have to be looking at Toronto and Edmonton and goes, thanks uh, yeah. a lot, you guys, because we are now in a position where we have to pay Jokinen that kind of money. And if you would have asked either of us this at the start of last year, we would have said, let him go again. Yeah. But man, this guy has been, I think, the most impressive skater they've got uh, on the team this year. It's tough to be a general manager in the NHL for this very reason. When do you sign unrestricted free agents? Do you get an early jump on it to beat other teams? Yep. But maybe you might overpay. Or do you wait till after and see how the marketplace shapes up yep. like the Flames are in a position right now? Doesn't Ole Jokin have the Flames over a barrel? Are the nuts? Yes. <laughs> yeah, he does. It, the Flames aren't, yep. aren't a team deep at center. In fact, they're brutal at center. That's yep. the team's, to me, their Achilles heel. That's they're right. not very good at center. Ole Jokinen is their best center. But how old is he? Isn't he about 34 years of age, something like that, by the time next season rolls around? Um, when he was making $5 million, we thought he was a bum. Yeah. Traded him out. Brought him back, got a new contract. What's he now? Three, three and a half? Yep. I think everybody's, now he's the top scorer on the team. <laughs> he's a great player because he makes less. Yep. Now, where do you fit in? Um, to me, Ole Okunen, I heard he wants term. He yep. wants four years. That's what I Because he likes Calgary. Apparently his yeah. family really likes Calgary yeah. too. His kids are at a private school in Calgary. They love it. His wife loves it. So they're, he's been around the NHL, the Phoenix, to New York, to Florida. He wants to stay here. Um, so perhaps he might take a little less, Mike. But I don't think he'll take less as far as term. So the question is, do you want Ole Jokinen at four years at over $3 million per year. Would you make that deal? Only if, if, there, is a, only if there is a, a clause in there that didn't allow him to make radio commercials. I'm Ole Okunen. <laughs> this is Ole Okunen. The best team players are dependable, like the people at Contra Hills Toyota. <laughs> you just can't have that shit. That's <laughs> brutal. <laughs> but those, but Hemsky, I haven't heard those commercials. Oh, they're brutal, yeah. Oh, well, maybe I have. A Toyota, just, yeah. Yeah, I, I uh, yeah. To me, so I guess the bottom line here is the Flames are in a tough position because they need centermen, but they don't want to probably keep uh, Ole around for four years. Two years would be perfect. So they might have to go two years and sign him for $4 million per season. That's a lot. I think he might be worth it. You know, he has to look at Grabowski and say, well, look, this guy is... Grabowski's 27 years I old. I know, but he's also only a second-line center on any other team in the NHL other than the Toronto Maple Leafs. At best, Grant. Uh, he, Alice Hemsky was a big surprise there, the money he sure, got. Sure, because they were going to get rid of the guy. Uh, to me, I don't know. He's, he's a soft player. He's injured Hurt. a lot. Yep. Uh, so I'm surprised the Oilers would do that. Anyways, I, I hope the Flames don't sign Ole for four years. We've got Glenn Cross for uh, four. We've got Tangay for five. Glenn Cross is going to be a steal for four. I'm not saying that's a yep. negative, but Tangay for long term. Uh, do we want Ole Jokinen for four years? I say no, but they may have to because they lack centermen, so they may have to give him uh, three years, close to $4 million. I can't believe I'm saying that. Feeling the winter chill? Call the experts at Simply Yours Windows and Doors. Get the job done right, on time, and on budget. Their number one concern is your comfort. <laughs>